This is so easy! This is so easy! This is the easiest sport of all time! I'm Drew Franklin. I'm a co-host on Kentucky Sports Radio, and I uh, help run the KentuckySportsRadio.com website. We're out here at Keeneland on opening day, which first of all, shout out to the beautiful weather. Couldn't have gotten better weather for this. And uh, after a year away and not having full crowds, it's great to be here and see Keeneland back at full speed, especially for such an exciting weekend with the uh, LSU Tigers in town for some football. I brought the old man out. This is my dad, Mike. We call him Franco. It's his first full speed Keeneland trip. He's going to make us a lot of money. Keller, he helps with the beer count. Always like having him around. This is Kyle. He's going to help with the picks. This man just prints money. Keeneland doesn't want him here today. And this is the unofficial mayor of Lexington, Manny Robertson. If you're watching this video, you know Manny and probably have his phone number. I've been coming to Keeneland ever since I was up here at UK many, many years ago. Honestly, couldn't put a number on how many times I've been here, but I can put a number on how many times I've walked out of here with money, and that number is zero. <laughs> but that fate changes today. We beat Florida last week, and today I'm making some money. We're turning things around. Before we get to our picks, I gotta feed the tank and get this belly some burgoo. Y'all need anything while I'm gone? Beers, beers, burgoos. Burgoo is pretty much whatever they have in the kitchen, is my understanding, put into soup form. Uh, it might be parts from the garage, I'm not sure, but it is delicious, and I feel like Keelan's Burgoo is not talked about enough. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Let's stir it up just a little. I just saw a pea. I didn't even know there were peas in here. There's a pea. I saw a pea. A little tomato, like you said, a little, a little beef. Some beans, carrots. Really, Keeneland is a burgoo. It's just a collection of everything coming together and just making a nice, flavorful masterpiece. Tennessee? There's, there's another Tennessee fan down there. He wouldn't even believe you're in the building. Where? Big Vols fan right there in the hat. When I moved out of my house in Madisonville, Kentucky, to come to college at the University of Kentucky, he turned my bedroom into a Tennessee room. The TV remote was Tennessee. The wallpaper's Tennessee. The bedspread's Tennessee. I've been there. I've yeah, seen there's it. a little mini fridge with Tennessee magnets. And my childhood bedroom became a Tennessee shrine, and I haven't forgiven him for it. We're on the eighth race at Keeneland. We just won the seventh. See, this is this is the way to gamble. Just trust the people that know what they're doing. I don't pretend. Exacta box with three horses, four, five, six, win place, and we're gonna we're gonna put our money. In. We're gonna go against it because it's four to five. I don't want to bet. Understand? Completely understand. So we're gonna bet on. We're gonna bet the four horse. I didn't. I didn't come here to bet on four to five. I, that's that's not worth showing right, up. So we bet. So we bet eighty dollars between the four of us. It's twenty dollars a piece. Let's go. I mean, it's so easy. I don't know why everyone doesn't do that. And they're off in the stall. Keenan Ogden Phoenix. Come on, six. Come on. Come on. Ah. I get it. We got it. Yeah, we didn't hit the exacta, but we got the winner. Hey, we didn't lose. Not losing is winning. Not losing is winning. Pot's right. Money's good. Let's roll it over. What we got? We're gonna do the same about same kind of bet. We're gonna do a three horse exacta box. We're gonna bet a win in place. So we're gonna go with the one, the eight, and the ten, and then we're gonna win in place on the one. But same amount. We're all four still in. We're all still up. We're gonna walk out winners. Hopefully we're gonna walk out big winners. So here we go. We got our does? voucher. We got our win placement. We got our exact box. Now go ahead and give it to him. Have him pay us out. We'll save time. We know it's gonna win. We can go ahead and beat traffic. That, that would be nice. Yeah. I, I don't know that they do that all the time, <laughs> but we, hey, we can ask. If we go three for three, they might have to consider it. <laughs> one eight ten, but we really want the one to win. And the Roth and the Darley El Sabiades. Juju's map in the final furlong of the Darley Alcibiades has a five length lead back to Matareya. Come on, eight! Come on! Come Juju's on! Juju's map and Florent Cheru to win it convincingly. What? No! God! This is so easy! This is so easy! This is the easiest sport of all time! Should we start a GoFundMe for Keeneland to have to pay us out? I think we should. We were already excited to be out here for opening day. Weather perfect. We had a year off. And then thanks to these guys, we're leaving in the green. Never done that. Went three for three in the six, seven, eight races. Excuse me, seven, eight, nine races. 
We're leaving with a little bit of Keeneland's money. We'll be back tomorrow, though. We'll give it back. We'll see you. Go Cats. One, two, three. Go, Go Cats! Cats.